hey there and welcome to another video with me in this video i'm going to show you how to add services and collect payment with acuity scheduling so stay tuned i'll walk you through on my pc right now okay here we are on my pc right now so you can add your calendar anywhere you want on your website or on your landing page so this is my website i've added acuity scheduling here for free discovery call and I've also added Acuity Scheduling here as a service, right? So I'm going to click here on Choose Your Services. As you can see, this is my Acuity Scheduling calendar. You know, uh, these are all the services that I offer, consulting and so on, right? So as you can see at the bottom here, it says Power by Acuity Scheduling. I've also got a, an example of a client of mine. You know, she owns a beauty salon and... Um, this is basically what we set up recently. So this is how her, her calendar looks like. So, you know, these are the, the type of services she offers. You know, as you can see, when you scroll down, you will see everything. And you can see here is powered by Acuity Scheduling. She's also got um, add-on, right? So things like if you click on Lashley, for example, and you will see that there's an add-on here right there's there's an upsell you can add to your appointment you can add like a eyebrow and wax tint to your appointment and this specific price will be added to the initial price which is 30 pound 25 cents right so that will be 45 pound 25 pence so that's an upsell i will also show you how to add this upsell so now what you need to do is let's head into our akichi scheduling appointment platform and then i'll show you how to do that so here we are on acuity scheduling and that's how our acuity scheduling platforms look like so in order to add appointments you need to click you need to come here on business settings and click on appointment types as you can see i have a lot of appointments here and you know and a lot of services there as well on appointment types here you do have two types of appointments you have uh, new type of services and then you and then you have new type of group class so if you're offering things like group class you can go ahead for the group class area here if you're offering things like like a one-on-one -on -one service you can also go ahead here and add a one-on-one -on -one service uh it's pretty simple we will go through both of them now so click here on new service and the name of the service is going to be website and the duration is going to be half an hour. The price is going to be forty-five pound, right? And I use the pound sterling, by the way. I will show you how to change the currency. If you use any other currencies, I will show you how to do how to change your currency. A category at the moment there is no category. I can create a category, right? So website, and then I'll save that. So this specific service is under the website 2021 category and i will choose a picture so i'll select the specific photograph right as you can see that's a picture uh, if i want this appointment to be public i can have the appointment to be public right if i want the appointment to be private i can let it to be private that will depend on me right so private means only admin and clients with direct scheduling link and book but i'll leave it i'll leave it to the public and click here on create appointment type so i have now created my appointment type it's called website review it's 30 minutes it costs 45 pound and it's on it's under the website 2021 category if i want to add like an add-on i can now now click an add-on here right so there are many add-ons here that are added in the past and i can just click here on add new add-on and the name of this add-on will be uh payment integration and i'll i'll put that 41 pound that's that's just an example right and that will be 25 minutes right and select an add-on so it's going to be website 2020 review and create new add-on that will basically means anytime somebody clicks onto the website review, they will have the suggestion to add a payment integration system 
for 41 pounds guys this is just an example so i have now added an add-on let's go back to the home page so we are back here into appointment types and we are going to create a group class so click on new type and i'm going to name that consulting it's going to be for two hours so 160 minutes actually 120 minutes the price is going to be 250 pound categories uh if i if, if i want to put on on the website 2021 i can do that if i want to create a new category i can also do that i can come here and choose a photograph i'll insert this photograph uh i do i have inserted the photograph here uh access to the public this is a class or event group where maximum number of people i can enter any number of people i want here i'll say 11. clients must sign up for all times this is okay i don't need the client to to sign up right just click here on create appointment types so now it says this is not available for scheduling please choose when this class is available by clicking offer right so the name of the class is here is 120 minute and that's the pricing that's the photograph maximum 11 people so let's click here on offer right let's let's choose the date and the time right so it's going to be on the 14th of january 9 a.m in the morning if i want it to be recurring i can click on recurring and edit some details here but if i just want it to be a one-off right i can just go ahead and leave it like that and click on save class so guys that's how that's how it looks like i have i've now added my consulting class with Ulrich Zerkwe the fourth the 14th of january at 9 a.m right so if you click on that this is how our consulting class look like now so guys make sure make sure after you do that you update appointment types right so i have now updated my appointment type uh is it was successfully updated it's called the consulting class for two hours and is for maximum of the maximum number of 11 people so after 11 people have booked it's not there's there's no longer going to be any spots available that's just for you to know so now once you've done that you now need to need to go and add our payment system so you need to come here on payment settings uh, our currency is the pound sterling right because that's what i use i live in england or uk you can decide any other currencies that you want there are so many currencies here the euro the us dollars the i mean australian dollars new zealand dollars and so on choose what you want our payment system you can have both stripe and paypal or you can have stripe i like to use stripe do, do you require a deposit if you require a deposit you can go for the deposit option right if you don't you can just go for full payment uh for service-based businesses sometimes they require a deposit of 75 percent it's just to you know kind of have like a guarantee that the, the customer is going to turn up and it's not going to mess around with the time so 75 percent deposit is, is is sort of decent so uh, also give clients the option to pay full amount yeah so i will so i've ticked that area so i can give the option to the customer to pay full amount if they want to uh let clients give an extra cheap uh really this is this is not really something that i normally take however if the client wants to give an extra cheap afterwards they can do that but i don't really take this area uh, now stripe settings so recommended clients can pay directly from your scheduling page they can pay from our scheduling page if i now want to integrate here 
there will be an area here which says connect your payment right so i will just click here on connect a few clicks and then connect with my payment system that will be all so because i've already connected my account with stripe um if i want to change that to paypal for example i will just click here change and then connect with my paypal account or if i want to change it to another payment system i can also change that to another payment system but i don't want to change it right so uh guys that's how you integrate so if yours yours will be this area for you will be connect with connect a payment because you have you haven't done it yet and it's just a few clicks and then your payment system will be integrated so once you do that you now need to come here on save settings just to make sure everything is safe right another thing that i want to mention is you also have the option to add packages gifts and subscriptions right so if you click on that you must be on growing plan or powerhouse plan i only use uh i use a different plan let me show you the plan that i use okay this is the one i use the i use the emerging plan which is 15 dollars a month however if you use the growing or the powerhouse plan you you can add packages and subscriptions right so you come here on packages and subscriptions and click on new appointment package you enter your title price here choose a photograph if you want to create a category description show printable gift certificate after purchase you, you know you can do that redeemable for total number of amount right this can be redeemed for number of minutes total or any of these appointment types right so guys you come around play around with this area if you're interested about adding packages into your acuity scheduling you can also uh, go ahead and do that through this area i'm only using the emerging plan it allows me to connect my payment system you know to and also to collect payment really so guys that was all about how to add services and collect payment on acuity scheduling if you enjoyed this content and found it useful type services in the comment section don't forget to subscribe to my youtube channel and i see you next time take care